What's up, y'all? Jay Sproul, Movies, Music, Sports, and Life. And um, y'all know I represent the far north side of Atlanta, Norcross, Georgia. But I also represent the mill, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, my hometown. And um, I'm doing this one instead of doing this one at the crib. I'm doing this one live from Clark Atlanta University because it's our homecoming this weekend and um, if you watch the last video you know people go shopping to get gear uh, I can hear the band practicing in the background but on the last video I was just looking around but now y'all can see what I actually bought got some Clark Atlanta pants they got the uh, the logo right here, so I think I'm a hoop in these instead of uh, instead of the basketball shorts I normally hoop in. But enough of that. We uh, come here every week to review the show that we all love, Atlanta. And um, one thing about the show that's kind of scary to me is. Is this the third or the fourth time that Paperboy has almost been out of here? I'm starting to lose count. So when his boy robbed him, I guess technically, technically you could say that that wasn't as bad because he was apologizing and stuff like that. But you heard him when he caught, he cocked that gun. So even though this was supposed to be his friend and he was supposed to be buying weed from him, you heard the sound. He was not playing around. He actually cocked a bullet back in the chamber for Paperboy. He just didn't shoot him. So that was one thing. Then he just narrowly escaped death by them three dudes when um, they was making fun of him for not having a car. And what, what you don't got a car? And then they decided they was, they was going to rob him. But Paperboy got himself out of that situation with a nasty Samoan headbutt and also wrestling the gun away. And he even managed to get a shot off, you know. Um, but whoever this dude was, is it just me or does it seem like there was something way more than just some dance? Like... That, that part is not adding up to me, man. It's like, okay, even Soldier Boy was scared and saying you gotta move if you ever made a video. But the way he was busting that gun at Paperboy, we way beyond just being mad about some dance video, man. That man, I counted no less than, he let off like seven, eight shots at Paperboy. And coming from somebody that's unfortunately been on the other side of a weapon, seven is too much. Cause once you hear the first one, you feel like you about to die. So I can't imagine anybody that has heard more than one gunshot come in their direction but yeah like this one was a little bit lighter on the comedy and it, it was kind of serious to me man I, I didn't laugh that much because you know i don't want us to lose paperboy like that but they seem to really be hinting that he's not gonna make it out of our favorite tv show alive man it's kind of messed up, man, because, you know, we all, you know, Paper Boy's our guy, man, so we don't want to lose him, but it seems like, it seems like it's going to happen. Um, in terms of the situation with Earn and, um, and Darius, I mean, I don't know, man. I, I don't want to get my channel taken down. I don't want to get flagged for you know, what some people might consider derogatory speech, but 
I just feel like the agenda at this point, they must not want us to, to keep populating the world. You know, maybe the world is just overpopulated, so they want everybody to be into the same sex so that we don't reproduce. Because it's just like, just all the time. You can't have a single TV show where they're not pushing that, you know? And like I said, it's not to defame, you know, that group of people, but they just really make it seem like it's not cool to be straight, you know, anymore. That's the only way I could put it. So, you know, I'm glad they didn't show them pissing because it just wouldn't have felt right. Like, if Earn is already saying he feel like he compromising himself just to get these shoes, then I don't want to see him kissing another man just to get some shoes. Like, you know, if that's how you roll, then you should be kissing a man because you like him, y'all in a relationship. But, you know, it's, it's whack to play around with that just for some material objects. And I guess that's the point that Earn, AKA Donald Glover was making too, is that we sell ourselves out, you know, for material things that aren't that important. All right, so hey, this is gonna be a short wrap up of Atlanta, cause uh, you know, I kinda got home coming on my mind, so I can't really be focused like I am when I'm in the house to uh, give you a real good review. But movies, music, sports, and life, this is your boy Jay Sproul. We out of here. If I can find a button, we out of here.